Oh, they bundled you up very neatly. It's kind of creepy, though. That hurts, you know? It seemed like you really wanted to talk. How observant, senor. Now, uh, say, uh, you got a smoke? I know those things will kill you. Oh, well, maybe just untie me then, huh? Joder, not this guy. Okay. Who are you? Okay, stop right there. Oh, he's the one injecting us this time. Mendez, chapter end. Standard. Chapter play time, an hour 28. Killed 34 enemies. Had died one time. Accuracy 80%. Times damaged 9. Sacrificial lamb. You will receive our most sacred body. It begins now. <laughs> oh, wow. They made him a lot creepier. Of Saddler. Oh, what the fuck? Hey, stop it. Hey, Yankee. Got your name? Leon. Quiet type, eh? I'm Luis Serra. Guess you, me, picked the wrong spot to vacation, eh? Hey, stop it. You move, I move. And I'm beat up in office cities. I can see you're thinking. Bet you've been in spots like this before, huh? I guess you're here looking for someone. <clears throat> One more guess. Maybe some missing senorita? Young girl. Talk. Now. All right. See, si. her chatter about moving a senorita. Moving her. Where? Who knows? But later. Saw some men dragging someone to the old church. Ah, hanging with you, not healthy. Oh. We're not done here. Later, amigo. Well, thanks for the key, at least. I like what they did with Luis. Shit, they took my gear. What? Oh, swell, I got nothing. Condor one to roost. I've located baby eagle. It sounds like she's being kept in some church. Great. That's good news. I heard it from this guy I met. He said his name is Luis Serra. There's something fishy about him. I need you to run a background check. We'll call Condor One. I'll see what I can find. In the meantime, make your way to that church. Right. I'm probably due for confession anyway. Condor One, out. Do you think maybe you could airdrop me in some gears? Since apparently I just lost everything I had. I'm assuming I get it back somewhere. Head for the church. Anything around here? Just a bunch of stuff I can't use. Okay, there's a crate. A green herb. I might hear something outside. Where the hell are we? We're underground. 
There was an underground section in the original. Around this point. Okay, we got a path over there with what looks like a body. I'm guessing I can't get down this way anywhere. It's not like fish down here or anything. Well, let me jump. Alright, well, let's take a look see at this guy. I'm sure you're dead and you're going to stay that way. Oh, you have an item. A kitchen knife, thanks. Knife attacks. You can perform wide sweeping slash attacks with the mouse button. You can also deliver quick stab attacks with the mouse button while holding space. Okay, so I guess if that's the only weapon in my inventory. Stab slash, okay. Oh man, this is going to be rough with just a kitchen knife. I hear somebody up here yelling. Let's slip in the sneak mode. Anything over here? No. I feel like maybe a shovel might be more useful. Okay, we're stealthing this dude. Stealth kills. You sneak behind an enemy when you have a knife, you can take them out in a single move without making any noise. Now this game's giving me a tutorial. Another kitchen knife. It's very weird it is now giving me a tutorial. F. Hey, that's my gear. All right, well, let's go get it. It's a huge rat. Oh, crap, we've been spotted. Parrying. If you have a knife, you can parry attack with space when a prompt appears in the bottom right corner of the screen. You can successfully parry even if you press it before the prompt appears. Time to right and the enemy will be staggered. So let me see how they do this in here. Bottom right. Okay, I see it. Seems like it's going to be hard to parry that way. I'm actually really good at parrying in video games, buddy. I probably should have told you that before you swung at me. Blame Dark Souls. Yeah, good ammo. Sapphire. I'll have to mess with my key treasures in a while. I could do it right this second. Bear traps. I'm probably going to be meeting the merchant soon, I would think. Can't go that way. Another kitchen knife. Okay, so this game's really afraid I'm gonna run out of kitchen knives. Uh, I don't see anybody. see me somehow. Is he going to come back around? Okay, hold the phone. You're not coming down that side, are you? Go Leon, go Leon, go Leon, go Leon, go Leon, go Leon. God. Okay. 
250 pesetas. Oil. Yeah, you might want to get out of here, rat. Nothing else around. anybody is that where my gear was I think so let me look over here real quick that's the door that takes us out gonna move back. We need to run. Go, Leon. Go. Alright, made it. I missed you. I'll be taking these back. Oh, a lot of kitchen knives here too. I think it dropped everything I had in my inventory on the table before I picked up my original stuff. That was strange. Another chest I can't get into. So I'm guessing I can get out this now. There we go. That almost sounds like the same exact voice. Let's do some business then, eh? Pest control. Get rid of the rats that have taken up in the factory. We don't know if they are carrying any diseases, but we'd rather not find out. Exterminate all the rats. There's three of them. I get three spinel for it. Okay, hold on. We'll go get the rats in a minute. I want to see what else is around here. And plus, I want to talk to him. 400 pesetas. Nothing else there. This I apparently need something for. I think... Does that take me out of here? Yeah, I think that might be the path I need to go. This is telling me there's something over here somewhere. This is telling me this way there is a rifle ammo. Oh, I see you took care of a request. Rifle ammo. Well done. Oh, what's this? There's a document. Merchant tip, get rich quick. How are the requests coming along? Did you know that you can trade the spinels you receive as a reward for valuable goods that can't be bought otherwise? We've got loads of useful items, but I recommend you pick up a treasure map the most. These maps detailed locations of the cult's cherished hidden treasures. It took me and the lads a lot of time to find them. With these maps handy, you'll never be skint again. Sure, you may have to venture into some dangerous areas to get them, but you can handle that, right? Me and the lads. Welcome. Howdy. Trading with the merchant. Weapons and items can be bought or sold to the merchant using pesetas. You can also upgrade or repair your weapons and equipment. Merchant requests. Once you've completed a task received from a blue request note, you can claim the reward by talking to the merchant. Okay. Good stuff, stranger. Destroy blue medallions. Got three spinels for that. And got achievement. some rare things on sale, stranger. All right, what do we got here? Bye. Bolt thrower. Quiet projectile. What is what I've got. 
Quiet projectile weapon that is great for immobilizing enemies. Bolts can be retrieved and reused. Can be equipped with attachable mines that function as proximity explosives. Okay, that's a new item too. SRM-1903. Bolt action rifle well suited for long range sniping. Three times power against weak points. Penetration power compatible with various scopes. We're going to want that at some point. This is telling me I don't have space for it though. Scope. Buy the rifle and get this free. Limited time only. I don't have space for it though. Standard optical scope with two stages of magnification. Anything you like, stranger. Can be mounted on the rifles and some automatic weapons. First aid spray, case upgrade. That we need too. Upgrades the size of your attache case seven times 12. Recipe for bolts allows you to craft bolts using resources and a knife. I am so happy this game lets me upgrade my knife. That was one of my problems with the original game. Your knife kind of becomes useless after a while, it feels like. Well, not useless, but it doesn't do very much damage. Durability. Restore the durability of your knife blade, so that fixes your knife blade. Ammo capacity. Reload speed. Rate of fire. Power. Shotgun. Okay, sell. Used key items. Key items that no longer serve a purpose can be... won't do you much good in the grave. I'm trying to talk to my audience. Used key items. Key items that no longer serve a purpose can be sold to the merchant. So that we can sell then. Thank you. Okay. We can sell the blue velvets. Thank you. We don't want to sell the flag in. We don't want to sell the ornate necklace yet. We've got rubies and sapphires. I could sell them my 19 kitchen knives. I'm gonna sell three of the kitchen knives. I'm gonna assume I don't need kitchen knives. I'm gonna sell all four of them. Well, well. I can certainly do something with this. It's a kitchen knife, dude. Calm down. Trade. Oh, okay. So you can get other stuff for the spinels. Oh, my back is killing me. Years haven't been kind to us, I suppose. Laser sights. Laser device aids in target acquisition can be mounted onto the SG-09R Punisher and Sentinel-9. So that, I'm going to guess, gives us a laser target like the original game had. We need to get that treasure map. A yellow herb. The Punisher, which would be an upgrade on a gun we have if we wanted to get it, probably. A round cut yellow gemstone can be in set in certain treasures. We're going to get the map. You we need to get that. Soft spot for treasure. I'm gonna hold on to the rest of my potatoes. I'm gonna hold on to the rest of my spinels for now. We're gonna buy case upgrade. A bit more space never hurt anyone. Perfect size for you, stranger. And then I think we're gonna try to save up to get this rifle. It says we don't have space, but I might have to clean up my inventory a bit. At a new gun, stranger. Come back any time. Okay, yeah, this is showing me different treasures. Now, the only thing is, how do we get back to where we were at? It's up here. So if we keep heading in this direction, we'll find it. All right, we're going to have some exploring to do. All right, well, first order of business is I need to go kill three rats for this budding serial killer over here. We're just going to pretend that they're infected with something so we don't have to feel bad about it. I had a pet rat once. His name was Slade, for those of you who've played Shining Force 2 on Genesis back in the day. It was actually named after that character. Let's not make this any harder than it has to be. There we go. He was a good rat. It's a very chill rat, just ate a lot and ran in his wheel. That's all he wanted to do. You're the one. Oh, okay, you're not the one I killed. You were trying to hide. I'm trying to make this quick. Come on. Dude. That rat just survived a series of quick time events. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Hi. Finally, man. Yes. 
That's nothing to be excited about, Leon. Let's not encourage killing defenseless animals. Wasn't trying to kill us, so there's nothing to be celebratory over. So that's a request done and dusted, eh? Good stuff, mate. Yeah, I killed the rat, you absolute psychopath. <laughs> well done. You've proven yourself reliable. Got three spinels for that. Okay, let me figure out something here. I really want to get my hands on a rifle. If I take this flag in, it's got spaces for two gems in it. So what happens? Okay, hold on. There's a ruby. There's a sapphire. Two colors bonus times 1.1. So it increased the value slightly because I'm using two colors. Okay, that's how you get some added value out of this besides just selling everything separately. Two colors bonus. Do I get anything if I put two rubies in there instead then? Take the ruby out of the necklace, inlay. Put another ruby in instead of the sapphire. Duo bonus 1.2. Okay, so that gives me a bigger bonus, but I lose a hundred pesetas because the sapphire is worth more. But I'm thinking I should use the rubies for this because if I get two sapphires to stick them in, then I would make more money. Whereas I'm only losing a hundred pesetas if I don't use the sapphire. I'm thinking I might sell this with the two rubies in it. I don't know if this is a good idea or not. All I know is this is going to buy me a rifle, so I'm going to sell it. Thank you. You're welcome. I've got We're going to buy this. It says I have no space. I probably need to clean out some. Your inventory is full. You must make space in your where attache you case. Your pocket? I'll tell you where I'm going to put it if you keep being a wise ass. Okay, that doesn't take up a ton of space. Yeah, let's buy it. Your enemies. We dreams from afar with a bullet straight through their heads. <laughs> Go on, take this as well. Free of charge. Okay. Standard optical scope with two stages of magnification can be mounted on the rifles and some automatic weapons. Limited time sale 100%. All my wares are in tip top shape. All right, let's grab this. You're a man of good taste. Oh, it is free. Check out that shake case. How does this work? Parts, examine, send the storage. Parts. Okay. Okay, that just equipped it. All right, so we got a rifle, which I need to set up with a shortcut. Now, can I use that with my weapon wheel? Okay, if I scroll to it with the weapon wheel and then I push the button, it'll equip it. That's convenient. <clears throat> okay, so there's our zoom. We don't use the mouse wheel this time. It's not like a gradual zoom. It's a this zoom or that zoom. Hello, stranger. Hello. Suppose we should move on. This should take us somewhere. Where I don't know. The hell am I? I often ask myself that question. That looks like somebody's uh, It's a granny. Yeah, it looked like that hurt. I don't know how I missed you there. Go go Oh, too late. that time oh wow you take a lot of hits that knife's not that strong there was like a look like a quick time thing there where are you going I must be out of your area or something so you're trying to retreat you're doing a terrible job of it. And now you're gonna come back, right? And you're... You took a lot of damage. 
800 pesetas, it was worth it. Yeah, it looked like I could maybe do something there, but I couldn't quite catch what it was. There was like a little icon popped up right before I started stabbing her. I'll have to check next time I get one of those on the ground. I don't know why I just slashed that ladder. I have nothing against it. Oh, the valley area. This was in the original. When I did this in the original, it got really rough. Like, really, really rough. Okay. I can move while I have this out. That's good. Well, let's start dropping people. Great first shot with my rifle. Can you guys not get to me? Is this not a ladder? They can't get to me. All right. Well, if you guys want to just stand there. All right. Apparently, I need some target practice. There's somebody else around here. Up there. What's that? Granny. All right. There's somebody else. There. There's another one over here somewhere. I can hear him. There's one right there. Hmm. That guy just retreated. This place is going to get crazy after I jump down there, isn't it? Oh. Let's go. 